So the deadline, not the biggest deadline we've seen. A lot of trades though coming at the end. And the big one, I was joking around Stevie Y to save the deadline. And I had been talking about it the last week or two. I wonder if Anthony Mantha is a guy that can get dealt at the deadline. And it happens. Anthony Mantha to the Washington Capitals in exchange for a first round pick, a second round pick, Panic, and Vrana. Vrana pending RFA. We'll see what kind of contract that ends up being. We would imagine it's over six, maybe even pushing seven. I would even put maybe Vrana as like a, maybe that Nylander comparable. Um, upwards of six for sure. Mantha, three more years at 5.7 after this one. I'm still in shock because I just didn't think a big deal was like going to happen like this. But I think my perspective also is um, we've seen it with Chicago in the past. We've seen it with like LA. When Cap comes into the scenario, you have to make panic moves sometimes that won't look good. And for the Washington Capitals, they want to be a Stanley Cup winning team again. And they had the concern of not fitting players into the cap next year. So they bring Mantha in. They overpay. This is a huge win for Detroit. And I think there is concerns here about Washington coming out of this core of Ovechkin, Backstrom, Oshie, go on. They are going to have concerns with Seattle actually too now. I mean, this is also like the big thing. Seattle expansion draft. They add Mantha into the picture and there was already concerns of maybe losing Oshie. I, I, they're going to have to toss something to Seattle or maneuver around. Um, we will see. We will see. But my perspective here is this is a fleece job. This is a finesse from Stevie Y, the Red Wings. I want to see Mantha with the Capitals. I think he could turn his kind of trajectory around here. Um, but, man, I like Verona a lot. And I think the Red Wings just, for what they're doing here, no, they didn't trade Bernie. No, they didn't trade Glenn Denning. But they got quite the haul here. So I love this for Detroit. I really do. Capitals, it all depends what they do in the playoffs. But I love this for the Red Wings. This deal is, like, really shocking. Like, really shocking. That's why it's like a, it's not even a thing to freak out. Like, I would have freaked out if it was, like, Verona, yeah, for Mantha straight up or, like, a second-round pick. It's just, like, a first and a second. It's a lot. Just insane. Uh, Stevie Y is a genius, man. He's going to really turn this Red Wings team around. Don't get me wrong, though. Anthony Mantha is an absolute stud. I think with his size, his shot, we've been able to see his shot just get to a crazy level. And when he's consistent, he is a premier scorer, a big body on the forecheck, and just a truck at times. So I think for Anthony Mantha, he could be huge for this Capitals team on the power play in that top six and for potentially another cup run. So don't get me wrong. This is a big get for the Capitals. But losing Verona, a first and a second, it's just a lot to give and a huge risk. And they're betting that they're going to go for it.